An April shooting at Lido Beach shocked everyone on the Sun Coast, including a family visiting. Tonight, SNN's Jennifer Vagelis talks to that family and has their side of the story. Nearly two weeks ago, shots were fired at one of Sarasota County's most popular beaches, a brawl involving almost 15 people, including children. Now, one Sarasota man involved is explaining his side of the story about how his family's beach day ended in blood. It's ending the ugly way. Sarasota resident Eli Gonzalez was just trying to defend his 18-year-old daughter, Priscilla. Yeah. Walking alone with her younger brother to their car when two men approached her. They kept yelling at me, like trying to catch my attention, and, and I told him to like leave me alone. One of the dudes um, started touching my leg and, and my inner thighs. Authorities say one being 20-year-old Andrew Cervantes, arrested Monday for battery. Priscilla says she then called for her father on the beach, appearing shortly after, telling them to leave. He just punched me in the back and start fighting with him. My brother-in-law started fighting with the other one and a bunch of people come to fight us. Priscilla then locked herself in the car along with four other family members. Meanwhile, Eli's brother-in-law, 27-year-old Ranciel Pajes Cajuso, grabbed a gun from the glove box. He just to the floor to stop the fight because so many people fight us. A woman from the other party grabbing the gun. I started chasing around my brother around the car and then she was like trying, she was um, hitting our car windows and trying to unlock our doors. Eli says police arrived to the scene 10 minutes later. I was just defend the bomb. On Lido Beach, Jennifer Vagless, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. And you can stick with SNN for updates. This incident is still under investigation.